I'm with Fran Hopkins today, and she's the creator of Steppables. How you doing? Very good. You know, about a month ago, we were here, and we were talking about putting ground covers underneath existing shrubs. Right. It was changing your carpet, and you gave us a ton of ideas about using Steppables, but now you've redone your whole front yard, right. and you've done a lot of different ideas that you wanted to create, show off Steppables, but also to keep it um, lower maintenance, sustainable. So here, you've really replaced all that brown lawn into oh, a green carpet of elf and thyme. Right, right, right. Uh, we took all of our elf and thyme and we planted it straight out and to create an absolute lawn substitute. And it's just beautiful. And I mean, if you kind of squint, it looks like lawn. I mean, right, it's from, beautiful. From people passing by, they think we actually have a lawn. And, and we have people who pass by all the time and actually come up because they want to touch it and they oh, want to feel it. Cool. They take off their shoes and they walk through my front yard now. <laughs> But there's other ones that you use too, and that one down there, the purple one? Right, that's the Acana purpurea, mm -hmm. and we did that last time underneath the azaleas. Right. And what I wanted to show in this landscape now is that in full sun, it's bright red. Mm -hmm. And then again, when you take a look at it in the shade area, it's mm -hmm. part, it's it's like a, a almost a maroon color. Mm -hmm. So all of these plants will change attributes given the different amount of light, water, foot traffic, all of them change mm -hmm. depending on, on what you're going to do with them. Fran, with all this diverse amount of plant material, I bet you get a lot more insect activity, bird activity. We do. We have a lot of bees. We have a lot of hummingbirds. We have a lot of squirrels, oh. <laughs> um, a lot of butterflies. It's, it's really quite quite nice actually oh. now. And I know there's so many different kind of levels here. You even have steppables around your stairs and inside the staircases. Right, we developed that with the landscaper so we could put the steppables right inside the stairs themselves. So as you come up, you can see the plants themselves and you're not walking on them. Mm -hmm. And then we actually built in a living staircase with the steppables creeping up and over oh, each neat. little hill. So that way you could walk right on them. Ah. So steppables, the type of plants, you have something for every kind of category versus sun and shade and drought and wet. Right, right. We have everything. Um, whatever a landscape would have to have in it are plants that we try to try to find with their attributes. Mm -hmm. So if you have a hill and you have a slope that you need to plant, you can use our plants and it'll hold actually in the bark. Okay. And I know this kind of landscape too, next year you're going to have a little bit less maintenance because right. they're a little bit more right. um, drought tolerant, yeah. aren't they? Definitely, definitely. I won't have to mow. Ah. Um, the watering will be quite less because, uh, for example, the elephant time that we're standing mm -hmm. on is a drought tolerant plant. Mm -hmm. It's a low watering plant, so the, uh, we have very low emitter um, sprinklers on the system, mm -hmm. so it takes very little water, which is nice. so cool for the environment. Sure. So everything that we're doing is we created a very nice little ecosystem right in our front yard. Ah. And I know that your um, steppables are in many different independents and Fred Meyer, and on the website, it's a great website. Right, right, right. You can go to Steppables com and you can find your store locator right there you can find your retailer closest to you or and if you don't want have one closest to you you can get it on the internet uh, as well that's great well I think every homeowner could say you know I don't want to mow anymore I'm gonna <laughs> put some creeping time down but there's so many ideas here and just be creative be, cr be creative and, and have a good time because that's what it's all about it is well thanks so much for having us out and seeing this beautiful renovation